Okay, okay. Oh no. And for instance, eyes are very reflective. So that's also a part, right? But that's not necessarily related to uh, to uh, color. That's that's also part of uh, material studies, right? So the color becomes, in essence, is a. Uh, so it, it, this is more of a light shadow study, but you need color to visualize it as well. It could be black and white. Right, uh, we can remove all the saturation, and you see that we put a lot of focus on the apple, obviously. Uh, but yeah, with with brightness, uh, yeah, with saturation, like black and white, you can really see also what should be brighter and what should be less bright, right? Which is also important. Uh, you see, just only using color can be deceiving as well. The values, exactly, Alina. This, these are the values. So this wall will not have any light. The ceiling won't have any light. So these, this should all be much darker, right? Because we have the light source from the moon and this light source. So this part, this part, like this, this is kind of the, the brightness. Everything outside of, of the kind of the little square in the middle in this case is uh, not having a lot of light now of course when you use digital programs you can put let's say uh, what is it overlay color darken color you can make a layer with color and say like okay this is the torch. Just make a black and white painting and, and do it like this. As an example, right? Uh, mm -hmm. uh, easy, it ain't cheating. But then what I want to bring a bit out there is, is the just the having fun with colors is a lot, right? Let's add a bit of purple here and there. You know, it doesn't have to be all correct to have fun. Add some purple here and there. I think that is a, a something I, I want to kind of emphasize. Uh, <laughs> I forgot how to get good values with watercolor. Yeah, watercolor. It's watercolor is difficult. It's like me using now like a brush on thirty percent opacity, and like just slowly. Add, oh wait, my layers and uh, right. Let's close these. So for instance, watercolor. It's like the opposite of of acrylic, where you really wanna. Do everything layer by layer. And you kind of have to plan stuff. So let's say I'm painting some mountains right now. 
then we'll add a bit of here. Well, it's a bit hard to emulate watercolor, I guess. Well, watercolor is fucking hard, okay, Lena? <laughs> you messed up. You chose watercolor. <laughs> Yes, the conclusion is put just put a little purple, man. What it doesn't hurt anyone. Come on, come on. Just a little purple. Uh, but that's a good point, actually. Uh, black. Black.